Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to be doing my recommendations, what to avoid, and my wish list for this month's Ulta 21 Days of Beauty. Now, what the sale is, is basically every day, Ulta's gonna have selected items off for 50% off. And then throughout the month, they also have beauty steals, which will be on sale throughout the month every single day. So I'm just gonna go over some of my picks for you guys and some of the things I think you just shouldn't even bother wasting your money on. So it actually started on September 2nd and I suck and um, I'm late on this video because I have so much I need to do. So we're just going to forget September 2nd and September 3rd deals. The only thing you did miss out on is a Too Faced Hangover Primer, which is amazing, but uh, hopefully you pick that up. So we are going to start on from September 4th and on. So I'm going to start off with the things I'm recommending for you guys. The first thing I'm recommending is on September 5th and that is the Benefit Hula and Hula Light Bronzers. I do recommend both depending on your skin tone. If you have my skin tone, I actually literally recommend both. I like the light for just a light bronze and then I like the regular hula for a contour shade. They'll come in separate boxes, but this is like the hula shade and this is the hula light. They are lovely. They blend beautifully. They are originally $30 and you can get them for $15 each and I think it's a real steal, you guys. Definitely consider getting those. They're really good staples to have in your collection. Now, I don't have a really good thing to recommend recommend until September 13th where they are going to have Clarisonic brush heads for 50% off. If you're like me, I use a Clarisonic. I don't know, they're just a good deal. It's a good time to get them for 50% off. So they are normally $27 to $32 and you can get them on September 13th for $13.50 to $16. Another really good item is on September 14th, the It Cosmetics Brow Power Universal Eye Pencil, which is originally $24, is going to be $12. Now this is really good. It's not my favorite pencil. I really like the Brow Wiz or really skinny brow pencils. This is a thicker one, but it's a really good brow pencil if you like them thick. Also on September 8th, the ABH Brow Definer is also on sale for $12. Well, $11.50. They're both really good. I haven't tried the Brow Definer from ABH, but I'm sure it's great. I've just tried this, so I am recommending it to you. It's really good. Also on September 15th, Tarte Mascaras go on sale. The 4-in-1 Lights Camera Lashes and the Tardis Lash Paint Mascara. They're going to be $11 each. Originally $23. I personally really like the Tardis Lash Paint Mascara. I think it's really good at separating, so this is a good time to get it because I I don't believe in spending a lot of money on high-end mascaras, but if you do like this high-end mascara, it's a good time to get it for only $11, which is drugstore price. On September 16th, you can get the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette for only $24.50. It's originally $49. Now, I believe Too Faced is trying to kind of phase these out of this collection, which is very sad, but I still use this guy. I bring it to travel. I use it on other people when I do their makeup. It's just really good basic brown colors, and it smells like chocolate. So even though they are trying to phase this out, this is so good, you guys. Get it while you can and get it at 50% off. On September 17th, First Aid Beauty is putting their Pure Skin Face Cleanser on sale. Originally $20, you can get it for only $10, which is amazing. Now, this isn't by any means the best face cleanser that I've ever used, but it's really, really good. It's a simple, good $10 face cleanser. I'm actually kind of mad because I bought this two weeks ago before uh, I knew it was going to be on the sale, so I could have gotten this for $10, but it's a good basic cleanser. And the last thing that I'm super recommending for you guys is the last day, September 22nd. I'm going to recommend that you pick up the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. It's a great setting spray and you can get it for only $16 originally 32. It's a good staple. Everybody swears by it. It really makes your makeup last longer and you can just, you know, get it for 50% off while you can. Also, if you're looking for a good moisturizer, there are a lot of good moisturizers that they have on sale. I would recommend either on September 21st, the Clinique Moisture Surge 72-hour hydrator. You can get that guy for $9.50. 
that's so good. I really do like Clinique moisturizers. I don't like much from Clinique skincare line. They do have good moisturizers. And the It Cosmetics Confidence in a Cream, $24 is what you're going to get it for on September 22nd. That guy's a little bit better than the Clinique. I don't know, I think it's a really good cream. I've used it before and if you're looking for a moisturizing cream, why not pick it up for 50% off? All right, so let's go into the bad. I don't really have that much because I haven't tried a lot. There's some things that I personally wouldn't spend my money on, but I don't wanna tell you that if I haven't tried it before. But the first bad thing that I'm saying you should probably step away from is the Tardis Quick Dry Matte Lip Paint on September 6th. You can get them for $10 each, but honestly, I hate this liquid lip formula. It shows every line and wrinkle in your lips, and I just, I can't. I don't like it. I wouldn't pay $10 for it. On September 9th, Bare Minerals is selling their Mineral Veil Finish Powder for $11. Don't do it. It makes you look really dry and it gives me bumps on my face. So, not even worth the $11. On September 20th, Cover FX has their glitter drops and customer enhancer drops for 50% off. Honestly, I just don't like those products. I don't like liquid highlighters. Even the Cover FX, which a lot of people like, I personally just don't like them. I've tried them before. I don't think they're worth the money. As well as the glitter drops, I just don't know when you're going to use them. It's straight glitter. It's just not worth the money. That's actually all I have for the bads. Just some things that I am considering picking up. I probably won't, but I do want to try. On September 12th, Derma Blend, their original setting powder is only going to be 13 I have a thing for loose setting powders and I just heard really good things about it. Also on September 20th, the Origins Must Have set will only be $12. It's just a whole set of trying out some little of their things from their line. I've tried a moisturizer from Origins that I really love, so I would like to try more from their skincare line and I think that's a great way to do it for only $12. I mean, I mean for the most part this month, I just don't think is their best 21 days of beauty. They just don't have a lot of things that really stand out to me if I'm being honest. Uh, but they do have some good stuff that you don't have you might want to check out. So I'm going to go to their hot buy sections where these items will be on sale every single day during the month for 40% off. So you can get some pure eyelashes for $4 to $8, which is really good for lashes. I've tried a few of them. They're pretty good. Would definitely recommend. Also, a Dose of Colors has their lip glosses for $10 each, which I'm so excited about. I love lip glosses and I do like the Dose of Color lip glosses, so that's it's a really good price that I think I'm gonna check them out for. Everything else looking, it just doesn't really catch my eye. Let's see, the Tarte Tape Shape Foundation will be $23. Do you guys remember the whole debacle with that? <laughs> Not surprised it's on sale. All right, honestly, everything in the 40% off just isn't doing it for me. So I'm gonna stop the video there. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and you found it helpful. I would love to hear what you're picking up this month from the sale. Put it down below or even what you're not interested in at all. Just put it down below. I would love to hear from you guys. So I will catch you guys in the next video. Have a great day and yeah. <laughs> Bye.